It's always lucky. It's always lucky. Well, you'd be absolutely enraged. Sullivan, absolutely enraged. You could sense it. Ronnie O'Sullivan had one foot in the quarterfinals, and then that, the Miss Green, the rest flung across the arena. Thank you very much. No, fellas, just play on, yeah? Sure. All right. Uh, this is a little bit, it looked like it was a bit funny there, but the referee got involved. It's far from funny, but uh, mm, never, ever seen that before. To say, well done, and look at that. Ali Carker, after all this time, manages to beat the Rocket Ronnie O'Sullivan, and that's what it means to him. And in the end, he wins 13-9. I think he's a happy bunny. Well, it's just a lot of emotion, you know. Um, you know, I've waited a long time for this, and I'm someone that doesn't like losing at all, and it hurts me. And f to lose to him twice in the final really did hurt me. So to go on and, and pull off a victory like that, and obviously that was just a bit of letting it all go. You've spoken to you backstage? Yeah, he um, wished me all the best, shook my hand. You know, I've got the utmost respect for Ronnie, um, and I'm sure he has for me too, you know, so everything's all good. No. It always looked. Wow, look at that. Sullivan, no. What a reaction. Down came the fist. And that was hard, that fist. He's tried to tell himself. We keep seeing it in interviews. You know, I'm just here to enjoy it. It doesn't really matter. It matters. It matters more than anything. What just did you see? That's it, that's it, that's it. Come on, tell me, what did you see? Can you tell me what you said? Can you tell me what you said? So, you saw nothing? You saw nothing? Can you look at the camera? You saw nothing? I'm not... I'm not sure what went on there. Something was said, but... And Judd... Nothing to do with Judd. Sorry. Yeah, but I had to say something, Judd. I had to. could have said it after the game. I had to. Salim was able to keep away from fouling a ball underneath him. But he's so angry well, with so himself for missing six. that red. He leads by 21, but that's far from decisive. During the match I felt like it was a little bit disrespectful the way he played. Every time I put him in a snook he just got down and hit the balls 100 mile an hour and could have gone anywhere. So I don't know whether he was just in that frame of mind but I just felt it was a little disrespectful to me at the table. But last three frames he played great, I got no complaints. So you're almost feeling as though he was being reckless. Not reckless, just obviously disrespectful to me. I mean, rather than obviously like, sometimes like, if, you, if you've got no shot, you get down and you can just hit him as hard as you can and hope you try and flute one. I think you can actually, <laughs> beg your pardon. I just... Ooh. <sighs> Missing those is, it sure. really matters, is it, if you miss Fine. that. But clearly Ding will not need the blue with his 12 point lead. O'Sullivan continuing to show frustration. Ding. As we know, he's a perfectionist. The fact that he's leading will not be of entire consolation to him. And there's a nice little shot. Stun for the pink. And then chance to bring some more reds into play. And it's not worked out. I think you get Ronnie's reaction. 18. Very frustrated with the outcome of that shot. Could have played that better. Could have played the black bet, the position on the black better. Bet that was where it went wrong. Is there a problem with the black spot? Yep. 
it, it, it doesn't. Like that yeah, it is not. Yeah. It doesn't. Uh, it rolls off. It's terrible. Just play the shop, please. It's terrible. You've done it so it don't go. No, it goes. Yeah, it goes now. That's, because that's, I've told you to put it on. But that's why you, I checked it. It's terrible. Twice. Just play the shop, please. Twice. I've had to tell you. Some difference of opinion about the spotting of the black. This effectively benign all. Wow, what a gift of Sean Murphy. Well, uh, this is awkward queuing. Oh, what a kick! Sullivan, what? Oh, this is a monster. Oh, the cue ball takes off. Ah, oh, wow. Well, yeah, please, no need, no need for argument. I, please, guys, shut, come on. Guys, just leave it. Can we, can we just play snooker? Please, guys. Really? Ronnie, can we just play on now? I think Mark will be careful now. Guys, it's time now. Please. What an extraordinary exchange. But I have to start by asking you about the verbal exchange in the final frame. I oh, know, it was just nothing. You know, sometimes when someone's continuously in your eye line and when you're on a shot and he's moving, maybe I sort of made sort of get into your opponent's head or try to put him off but you know it is what it is and I just thought you know I'm going to pull you up on it I'm not going to let it go there's no point letting it go and he carries on doing it so I just thought let's just get it out of the way and it was done but he deserved he deserved his victory you know oh, would you believe it oh he's not happy with that he Are didn't push the queue through in a straight line he just come across that we've seen Young Jeff Trump do that when it was much easier than this, but missed to the same side of the park, and he drops the cue in disgust. Yeah, not the ending to that visit he was looking for. There's no way in a million years that they'll touch it and trick it on the screen. I've checked it before. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think. Well, I, I'm sorry, Ray. Right. Now, Ronnie, just yeah, just settle down. Just don't get yourself upset. If the referee says it's touching, just, uh, well, that looks touchy, is it? You play from touching ball. Well, sometimes, as you said, Dennis, the ball can sometimes rock back, and it is made a difference. He's very annoyed, Ronnie. Oh. Oh. It just parked his way around and somehow found his way into the middle of the bunch. And в один красный, играть другой. Но если виден только левый шар, ну а в среднюю-то он проходит. Да, да, какой удар! Но и туда же надо играть черный. Это удар на сотню.